turn my volume down. Greetings friends, welcome, what ho and all that jazz. Welcome to 2013 Summer Crate unboxing video. Here we are, here we are. You're looking at me, vest, because it's freaking boiling outside, it's ridiculous. I've come inside and think, Christ, been out there all day. Random few days up in Nottingham, which was pretty freaking awesome. Hello to Nottingham peasants, if you live up there. Um, anyway, so we're just going to jump straight in and get this open done with. As you can probably see, I'm wearing a t-shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Tan lines. Anyway, here we go. Looking slightly at that little thing there. I'm going to close you. Hang on. There we go. Right. Here we go. Let's have a look, shall we? Right, so we've got the items. I'm going off into the corner right about now. Items. Backpack. I have a stupidly full backpack full of crap. I have no idea what we can get from these crates. We can get... A... I've literally never heard. Apart from the Pocket Pyro, that's the only thing I've actually heard of in the entirety of the, uh, of the whole, of the whole lot. So I don't know what to get. Quick thank you out to those who did donate a random bits of bobs. Ask for a couple of crates. People gave me some crates. I even got a key, which is freaking awesome. Thank you very much. You know who you are? Thank God for the Steam Marketplace because I can spend £1.45 on a key instead of £1.99, which is awesome, saving 54 pence. I actually saved about a fiver. It was awesome. Right, anyway, let's get... We've got eight. We've got eight to go, so we're just going to pick randomly. I'm just going to pick this random key. Yours with... Right, uh, let's go for this one. What do we get? Yes, I'm sure. We do this every single time new crates come out. So here we go. First one to get is... The Pocket Bloody Pyro. There we go, the Pocket Pyro. Loneliness is the world's deadliest silent killer. Next to carbon monoxide. But cuddle up to this adorable firebug, hold your breath, and you'll be free to concentrate on loud killers like car crashes and Freddy Krueger. Awesome. So we got the Pocket Pyro. That's pretty freaking cool. Anything that I don't use will probably end up going into um, TF2 Warehouse. I never know how to get out, like one or two items. It never seems to work very well. It just seems to be a bit of a shambles. So, we're going to unbox the second of the th of the eight crates that we have. We've got another, I bet it's another Pocket Pyro. Oh, it's not. It's the pom-pommed provocateur. The thick, the thick woolen pom-pom stitched to the top of this ski mask is filled with poison in case you are captured by people who want to, <laughs> who want information, information on why you look ridiculous. Yes, I, mm, not really a fan of the pom pom uh, provocateur, so I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Uh, let's move that. Now, the next one. We're going to go over here today. So this is box number three. Is it? Yes, it is. It's box number three out of eight. And we are getting the pocket bloody pyro again. I don't want pocket pyros, to be honest. I'm never going to use it. They're both going to get traded in, I should think. Use with the first of all eight crates. It'd be nice if I got something remotely interesting that I'm actually going to wear. The Cloud Crasher. Yay! This paratrooper's helmet keeps your head safe while you jump out of planes. Show those birds whose boss teach some fluffy little clouds what they'll get if you, <laughs> if you ever catch them around your sky again. For now, I mean, for my soldier, I've got my, um, my unusual, so I'm probably not going to wear that either. So far, we're going to be trading in a lot of gumph. My phone just went off. Excellent. So that's been four. Let's move you, Sir Pocket Pyro, over there. So we're halfway done. Halfway there. Four more to go. Excellenteo and all that boob. Okay. I actually quite like that. The Powdered Practitioner. I actually quite like that. I could wear that. I can go with my beak. Anyway, an integral part of any travel survival kit. This wig will help you escape Disney. Excellent. Disney World... Disney help you, sorry, help you escape Disney World if the Hall of Presidents ever comes to life. Fantastic. Comes with tri <laughs> tricorn hat in case Pirates of the Caribbean comes to life instead. Excellent. So we're covered. We're pretty much covered for if anything wrong goes on. One, if Disneyland becomes real. And two, if Pirates of the Caribbean becomes real. So we've actually got a hat that I'm going to keep. You are going to the front because I'm keeping you hat. Use with the final of the whatever craze. We've still got another two more to do after this, so meh. We could get something decent. I wouldn't mind something really cool, please. Oh, okay. The... 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 Ty... <clears throat> the... The... Ty... The... The... neck. The... Tyrtle... The... Tyrtle neck. That word. Around the ski necks. <laughs> Around the ski necks of an intellectual jewel thief or Frenchman, a turtleneck, tells people Sorry, a rather skinny neck of an intellectual jewel thief or Frenchman, a turtleneck tells people, comma, whatever, 
colon, please open hand slap me in the face. On the iron frame of a heavy it says, I wear what I want. So basically, heavy wears whatever he wants. Cool turtleneck there, not too bad. So we've got two of the same items, which was a bit of a letdown. We've still got two more to go. You've with that hexalentio boom fricka doom nooka noom noom noom. Oh baby, we got the Dark Age Defender. I was actually oh and some crates to piss. That is the ice cream van. The Dark Age Defender. This knight's armor will repel anything someone from the 12th century might throw at you. Be in a be it a rock, a sword, a thatched cottage, or even Merlin. And look, we even got a pallet of crates as well to piss off everyone on the server. Okay, excellent. Now guys, we go for the final one. I'm gonna be keeping that as well. I quite like the Dark Age Defender. The final one out of all of these things, it would look quite good with my parrot. Mm. Anyway, the final one we are going is this. What is it going to be? The Summer Appetizer Crate Series 61, the last crate to get. Please be something cool. Please be something cool. Unboxing my loot. What is it? It's going to be crap. It's going to be a pocket pyro. Oh, it's going another turtleneck. Another turtleneck. Oh well, we got some random bits and bobs not to freaking worry. Anyway, there you have it. There is my stuff. What did I get? I got the Powdered Practitioner, two Pocket Pyros, a Pom Pom Provocateur, Pom Pommed, the Cloud Crusher, two Turtlenecks for the Heavy, which I'll probably keep one of them, and the Dark Age Defender. Oh, and of course, a Pallet of Crates. So there you go, guys. There is the unboxing of this. Nothing spectacular, unfortunately, but we do still have these Summer Claim check things, which I'll probably do a video of one of them, providing they're not just stupid crates. I'm hoping there's something we can just unbox straight away. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I shall see you on as you. Don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe. Go over to the Facebook page, the link is down in the description below and give it a like. Same with my Twitter. More subscribers, more likes. Comment. What is the word of the day? The word of the day is... Uh, uh, I don't know. What can the word of the day... Word of the day is Disney. Disney. Whack it in a sentence. Disney. I know you've got this five. You got if you got the word on the comments. Thank you very much, guys. I've been here for a while. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you when I see you. When I see you, when I see you, I'm now going to throw you across the room. Goodbye.